What's <clears throat> what's up guys, Boss of Toys here, and today we'll be doing a video that I've wanted to do for a very long time, but just either didn't have as much as I wanted for it, or was moving. I'm actually in Tennessee now, so I have this new room, still getting fixed up, but I'm here now. <laughs> so, this is going to be my Imperial Army. Hopefully I make another one of these videos in about a year and it's twice the size. So first I should probably go over the soldiers before I get into the vehicles. Also I want to get another one of these so bad. Um, so soldier wise we have 10 snow troopers. Well, um, um, six of which came out of the snow trooper battle pack. Four of which came out in the at, -AT. We have four dark troopers, three came in the hallway, one came in the um, light cruiser. Oh wow, I'm bad at this. We have five regular storm troopers, four came in the iron marauders, one came in a tie fighter. We have the patrol troopers, which are really cool. Those came in the battle pack. We have the uh, artillery trooper, which came in the marauder too. And then we have the Snow Scout Troopers, which came in the same set as the Battle Packs. We have two at, -AT Drivers, which came out in the UCS at, -AT which is, of course, is not part of this built army because it's not built. And also, I think it would be unfair to these sets to have that in the army because they just can't compete with it. So the at, -AT is not in here. We have the Shuttle Pilot. TIE Pilot, ATST Pilot, um, Imperial Technician, I think that's what that is, and a Imperial Protocol Droid. And that's all for the groundwork. Let's go up to the chain of command. We have Darth Vader, which I don't think I have to tell you what set he came in. He came into a lot, but he came in that set. We have Moff Gideon, who came in that set. We have a Storm Tro Snow Trooper Commander, which came in the at, -AT. And then we have an Admiral, I think. I don't know. I can't get my camera to focus. Wait, hang on. There we go. So if you know what rank that is, please leave a comment. But for now, I'm just calling him an uh, admiral, because I don't have any. And that's about it for the minifig portion of this. Oh my gosh, I guess I fired off a stud. Okay, well, now I can give up. Okay, fixed it. <laughs> So we have two Imperial Armored Marauders, which is retiring this year, according to the rumors, so I might try and buy two more, because they are really great sets. And, um, yeah. We also have the Imperial Light Cruiser, also rumored to retire this year. I want to get one more before it does, for the army, of course. And then we have the Imperial TIE Fighter. I also want to get a couple more of these. I want to have at least four. I want to get another ATST. Um, the issue with that is I would just get, like, if I want, I want to get four of two capital ships, four Marauders, four of those, four of those, and two of those. That's also retiring this year, and that's already crazy expensive, so it probably won't. But we have the Snow... Um, the Hoth ATST, which is a very good set. I like it. Very uh, lanky limbs, however, I do not mind them. We have the one of the most controversial Imperial sets is the Imperial Shuttle, and that's because of that chin right there. A lot of people don't like that. I personally don't mind it. And then I have four Snow Speeders. And a um, patrol paddle back um, 
speeder bike, which is actually a really cool design. I really like this one. That's really nice. And then we have three, I think these are E-Web Blasters. I don't know, but I believe so. And um, I have three of those. And then I have an Imperial um, Probe Droid. And um, that's about everything I have in the army. It's not the biggest Imperial army. However, it is my army. And then I have 45 clone troopers somewhere in that. And I'm willing to bet my Imperial army could kill all of them simply because of the vehicles. I have less troopers, but I have better artillery. And honestly, the clone troopers only have a scout, scout, um, scout walker and a speeder bike. That's all the clone troopers have. They don't stand a chance should these guys invade. Um, of course, this is prone to change. It's probably going to get bigger before it gets smaller. Um, but if you guys have any thoughts, let me know. If you guys have any tips and tricks on how to expand this or make it better, let me know. And uh, see you guys in the next video.